Hey YouTube, Todd here back with another quick tip video for you today. And today I'm going to I'm going to show you how to how you can disable and activate tracks within Cubase 9. I get this question quite a bit on my template videos, the walkthroughs that I've shown. Uh, how are you, you know, making those tracks active? How are you doing that? Well, today I'm going to show you how to do it. It's very simple. As you can see, I have the key commands window open. If you don't know how to find this, just go to file and go to key commands here and it will bring up this dialog box. So I currently have it set up a key command for this option. I have the letter D on my keyboard, as you can see here. So you could find this shortcut within your audio folder, and then it's disable enable track. And what this does, I, there's a lot of confusion with this and what it does. Actually what it will do, so let me go to this track here, and let me get this out of the window here. So I disabled that track. What this does is it will disable this track and bring it out of my memory on my computer. So it's not using any RAM. It's not freezing the track like logic and stuff like that. People have a lot of confusion about this. So what it's actually doing is just deactivating the track and taking it out of RAM or the RAM and memory usage. So if you wanna build a, a huge template, this is the way to go. And if you go back and watch some of my full te uh, template video walkthroughs, this is what I'm doing. So what I do is if I wanna activate this track, I just hit the key command D. It takes a second to load up and there you go you have the track so it's very simple i just noticed a lot of confusion in the comments um, i get this question asked a lot so i thought i'd cover a quick video you know just make a quick little video on this to show you guys how to set this up in your own templates and how to use it i hope you guys enjoyed this quick tip video like always uh if you like this video please hit the likes button if you are not subscribed to the channel please hit subscribe and if you have any suggestions for future quick tip videos please leave them in the com comment section below and as always guys and girls thanks for watching and i'll see you on the next video